Assalamu alaikum everybody I'm Prince Mara and welcome back to my channel Mara Space The Champions League is back The Champions League is back this week Tuesday and Wednesday Please, before you do anything, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. And everyone, every football fan at least are waiting excitingly to start watching the Champions League matches. This season, I mean, there are new teams, especially from the Premier League. We have Newcastle, who newly joined this exciting adventure, and many other teams uh, around Europe. Anyway, let's get started with the matches. The we are just the starting we are at the group stage so on tuesday there are eight matches and eight matches on wednesday and then go on until we finish with the group stage to see the two teams that qualify there will be many surprises that's for sure there will be some shocking um results also for some teams let's get to know the matches that will take place this week on tuesday and on wednesday on tuesday of course the first week or the first match days of this one of the most exciting matches is in group f between ac milan and newcastle newcastle i mean ac milan for the last two or three seasons they did come back strongly in the champions league and they were improving we've seen them last season they reached until the semi-finals i believe yeah and then Newcastle, Newcastle after a very good uh, and smart investment this season are participating in the Champions League. We will see on Tuesday in Group F very 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 strong and exciting match that we cannot miss if we have time to watch it between AC Milan and Newcastle and then PSG and Dortmund. This is the exciting group that everyone was talking about after the draw. There will be a shock. There will be a shock. And if, if PSG are not paying attention, they will really be surprised with this team. Those are four young teams full of ambitions and they want to reach to the neck out stage. And we have Fenor Celtic, Lazio, Atletico Madrid. Lazio, Atletico Madrid, I think it, it's also a good match, but it won't be as this exciting match as Dortmund, PSG, or PSG, Dortmund, and AC Milan, Newcastle. That's on Tuesday. We have Manchester City hosting FK Zvezeva, Young Boys and uh, Red Bull Leipzig. These are the matches. And then we still have Barcelona and uh, Royal Amtu. This is an easy match for Barcelona, I must say. Unless we see some surprise and then FC Porto and Shakhtar Donetsk. Those are the matches of Tuesday. Eight matches on, on Tuesday that will be played. And then on Wednesday, what everyone also is waiting for on Wednesday. On Tuesday, we have PSG Dortmund, AC Milan, Newcastle. Those, I believe, are the most exciting matches on Tuesday. On Wednesday, matches are going to Germany to meet Bayern Munich in Allianz Arena. Manchester, we know their situation in the Premier League. They are struggling totally out of form. And in the other hand, we have a renewed Bayern Munich, a good Bayern Munich that are stable, very stable I can say and they are really 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 ready to continue making matches having this miserable season that they are having. So Bayern Munich, Manchester United and not to miss on Wednesday and then in the same group, Group A, you have FC Copenhagen and Galatasaray Group B, yes, I would like to really focus on this match between Arsenal and FC Eindhoven. And FC Eindhoven are a good team, we all know that. And then Arsenal, after so, so many years of absence from, we should say, the European football, especially the Champions League, they are back this year and they will have their first match. I think in the Arsenal uh, squad uh, right now, none of them really played the Champions League with Arsenal. So it's a very good uh, a new experience for them to try to improve and we will see how will they manage to do it facing um, 
PSV and Hoven. The good thing is that the match is in El, uh, in the Emirates Stadium in London. In the same group, Sevilla Lens. So this group also is tricky. Sevilla are good. We all know them. Arsenal are very in shape. PSV and Hoven, not so bad. And Lens from France, you cannot still uh, write them off. They still have a chance to qualify. Then we go to Group C, Real Madrid hosting Union Berlin. Uh, I, I, I wouldn't say it's an easy match for Real Madrid, but with the experience Real Madrid have, I think they can they can win that match. And in the group, they can easily qualify. They have uh, um, uh, Braga Sporting Club and FC Napoli from Italy. Those are the, the matches. And then in Group D, Benfica, FC Salzburg, Real Sociedad, and Inter Milano. Those are the match of this week of the Champions League. And then excitement, excitement, excitement from the Champions League. This is for sure. We will have it all. So, guys, enjoy. Enjoy your matches. Enjoy your teams. I'm a Liverpool fan. I'm away this year from the Champions League. <laughs> we will try to come back strongly. So, thank you. Thank you again for watching. Please, before you do anything, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.